Hello and welcome to this tutorial. Um, it's about downloading some free textures. Now, in the Fans of Sarah software group on Facebook, which I run, Angela H. Evans posted a link to get in some real marble textures. But then people started saying that it was impossible to download them and they were having a lot of trouble, or not so much. They weren't always impossible, but it was a sort of a faff to try and get these things to download. I've downloaded them, and uh, it is a little bit complicated, but it is doable. So I thought I would sort of try and show people how I've done it. It may not be the best way, but this is how I've done it. So once you click, when I clicked on the link, you get taken to this page, which is in the Affinity um, forums, and it's been posted by. I'm guessing it's pronounced better, B-E-T-R-E, -E. and I thank him or her for making these free and available. And there's a link here that we shall open up the next page, and there's also a link down here to get set number three, and there's also a link to get set number two, which you do have to pay for set number two, but sets number one and three are free and these are some of the marble links um, textures that are available if i come further down here I mean some of the comments at the bottom there are also lots of people here making comments about you know, they look great but they can't get um, them to download be it on sort of microsoft or on chrome so i'm going to sort of do it how I've done it and you may not uh, have any problems hopefully so if I click on the first link and it opens up you can download these individually if you scroll down it will sort of open more textures up you can download them individually by clicking on whichever pattern you like or you can click on the real marble set 3 or the marble set 1 to download them as complete sets. Now as I've already got the sets downloaded I'm going to sort of be showing an individual uh, pattern so I've got a couple already but uh, let's try this wood plank one I know I haven't got that one so I just click on this and now I'm doing this in Microsoft Edge I will then repeat this in Google Chrome um, and they're, they're pretty much the same so once you get to the one you want to download it will obviously show you a picture of it and you get five versions of this be it AO, Diffuse, Deplacement, Normal and Spectacular I really don't know quite how you combine all of these or if you do combine all of these to get the overall effect but this is what you will get when you download and then you just come to this download button here and click on that now, the first time you go there, it may open up a little message that says about being a patron. Um, you can just click to get rid of that and then click on the download button again to come back. And you should come to this page here. And then where it's got the name of the um, texture, little downward arrow, you click on that, come down to download and down the bottom here it will see it's being zipped now in Microsoft Edge well I get on this message um, do you want to leave the page so I just click on leave but it doesn't actually leave the page it will just come back with the message for downloading so I'll click on save wait for it to download and then open the folder and there I have the wood plank thing downloaded so I'll just right click extract all and wait for it to be extracted so I now have that wood plank texture the zip file and I should have it up here so I've now got 1k, 2k and 4k versions of that wood plank so like I said you get the five different versions so that's how I did it in um, Microsoft's Edge. If I drop this down, 
And if we come to Google Explorer, I've already got this opened up on the page from the Affinity Forum, and I will add a link to this page so you can um, get there as well. So, like I said, this is in Google Chrome, so just click on the same link, and again, I will pick some one that I haven't got already. Um, well, let's try that one. So, I'll just click on that. And then, like in the Microsoft Edge version, just click on the download button here. And and like in the Edge version, it may pop up with a window about uh, becoming a patron. Um, but you can just click to get rid of that. Or if you want to become a patron, you can join up. Um, just click on the download button here. And then, much like before, just click on the drop down menu and click on download. Now, I will be honest here and say this is my second attempt to try to get this one. The first time I clicked on download, it looked like it started to do it, and then it I waited about five minutes, nothing happened. So, hopefully, it will be okay this time. So we came up with the same message here, and it's got download ready. So now it's starting in Chrome. It appears down here where it is downloading, rather than in where on Edge it's sort of in the middle. And once it has downloaded, you can just click on that area of the thing, and it will open up the already extracted. Well, not so much. It's already exact extracted it's just showing you what's inside the zip file so if I click backwards to download and so it's wallpaper number 920 and whatever all those other numbers are so I'll just extract that um, extract all sorry I forgot what I was doing there and then wait for it to properly extract so I now have wallpaper, uh, where is it, oh it will be at the bottom. So much like before, I've now got the three different versions of that wallpaper and the five different versions of that particular 4K version of the wallpaper. Um, so that's how I've done it in Chrome and or Microsoft Edge. This does seem to be a bit convoluted but it's very doable. Um, if you are going to go with um, you want the whole set you can do it pretty much the same way because you've got number one and number three here and as I said I think versions sets two and four you have to be a Patreon to get but I mean, if I just click on that, for example, and it does tell you all the ones that are there, click on download, and much like before, you can do them all individually, or just click on the downward menu and go to download. I'm not going to download it because I have these already, but that is how you do that, and hopefully this will help some of the people who are struggling to download them. Thank you for watching and goodbye.